there. Um, so you can see this uh, beautiful surrounding area. Um, it's the kind of little uh, silver community garden that is maintained by the community in this area. I think they won a grant locally um, to maintain the area fairly recently over the last few years. And since the tulips have come out, um, we've come here today to take a few photos on various film cameras. As you can see here, they are, you know, drying on the floor and I've secured them in place with some convenient rocks that were in the area. Um, and we've got like a variety of different films. One is a Fujifilm Silk and the other is a Polaroid 690, I believe. Yeah, so basically they need to dry for a certain period of time and then uh, we'll put them in the bag and take them home. But yeah, I just wanted to show you the area because it's so nice. Yeah, so here's our yield for the day, you know, some of them came out more successfully than others, you know, um, as you can see, some of the shots are kind of overexposed and um, it turns out that we were pulling them out of the camera wrong, but, you know, other ones like turned out really well, um, you know, and they're in focus and so on. And some, but not all of these shots were taken with uh, this Polaroid land camera. Um, which is an automatic 220 and it was produced between 1968 and 1970. Um, it's a recent purchase however and we got it on eBay for about £25. Um, although I think the original cost was something like $85. Um, but unfortunately um, the, the camera basically the batteries are no longer produced I think for this camera so we had to do like a little hack um, and add, you know, kind of like a new battery pack uh, makeshift one. But nevertheless, you know, I think the, the camera was really like a good buy because we got a free case and like an old manual. And um, I love these kinds of, um, you know, peel apart films, which are, you know, largely not in production anymore. You know, there, there, are, there have been some kind of like independent companies that have taken up the 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 cause of uh, peel apart film and have started producing kind of uh new uh, models of peel apart film but um in our experience they, they've been quite temperamental so these are all expired films that we've had stored away for a few years now um anyway it's, it's quite gratifying to see them come out nicely um so yeah i hope you enjoyed the video bye <laughs>